Welcome to today's episode. Today we are doing part three of our taxable crypto investing activity series. And today we're talking all about cryptocurrency sales. All right, so let's jump right in. So cryptocurrency sales, you guys, are just when you give up your crypto and you receive fiat in exchange. So some of you may not know what fiat is, because as you know, we have a wide variety of, of users on this channel. So for those of you that do not know what fiat is, here we go, vocab lesson. So fiat, you guys, is just real currency. So for us here in the US, it's giving up your crypto for fiat means giving up your crypto for US dollars. Um, if you're trading in a foreign currency, which is also possible even as a US citizen, then it's whatever real currency you are giving up your crypto for. So if it's the yen, the pound. So giving up your crypto in exchange for fiat, okay? So when this happens, you guys, there's a taxable transaction. So if you have watched any of the other parts in this series, you know that anytime you give up your crypto, you are triggering a taxable event. All right, and there are certain pieces of information you've got to collect or your accountant's got to collect in order to record that transaction on your tax return. So that's what we're going to talk about. We're going to talk about the information you need in order to record this transaction on your 8949. It's a form on your 1040. And these transactions also go then to Schedule D of your 1040. So the basic information that you need to collect when you have a taxable transaction triggered by selling your cryptocurrency. Whew. All right. So you need the original purchase date of the crypto you sold. You need the cost basis of that crypto. So it's how much you paid for that coin when you originally purchased it. And, or it's also sometimes you guys call it the fair market value of the coin back on the original purchase date. You need the sales date of when the coin was sold, which you know, it's pretty, it's there. And then the sales price of the coin when you sold it. Okay, so those four pieces of information are what you need in order to complete that portion of your tax return. So original purchase date and cost basis or fair market value of the coin on the day you purchased it and the sales date and the sales price of the coin on the day you sold it. Okay, and so this is all in your, um, on whatever platform you guys are using to trade, all of that is in there, okay? However, a lot of you are trading on multiple platforms, and even if you aren't, even if you're only on one platform, the that platform doesn't track your information necessarily in a way that is um, friendly to preparing your the tax forms. So there are there are uh, tra tracking softwares out there that pull all that information from all the different platforms you're trading on and consolidate it and so we can track the original purchase price and all that of your trades, all right, and of your sales. So again, this is not something you need to worry about. This is why you hire the big guns, all right? But the whole point of this channel is just to know what your, to teach you guys what your responsibility is, okay? So today's lesson is to teach you guys that when you sell your crypto and you get fiat in exchange, you have triggered a taxable event that you need to file or need to report on your tax return when you file. All right, guys? Pretty simple today, right? So as always, I'm gonna tell you to leave your comments, your questions, and your suggestions for what you wanna hear about on this channel. This channel is 100% for you. So whatever you guys need to learn about or whatever you want more information on, or if there's something you want me to break down even more, let me know and I will put it out there for you guys. This is, channel is for you. And as always, I ask you to subscribe so you guys get notifications when we go live again or when we post another, we don't go live on YouTube. This is YouTube. So <laughs> amateur. Um, so you get notifications when we post. All right, guys. Thanks for tuning in.